Developing news, a driver hits two people and takes off. One of those struck is a Chicago police officer. Good evening, I'm Jim Williams. And I'm Mai Martinez. Thank you for joining us. The officer and the woman were both rushed to the hospital. Tonight, police are questioning a person of interest. CBS 2's Adrena Biggis is live at Chicago Police Headquarters with the developing story. Adrena? Good evening, Jim and Mai. Tonight, Chicago police tell us the driver who they say hit that officer and the woman is expected to be charged with aggravated DUI. All right, we got an officer down at 6 8 and state. An officer down. We need some cars to head that way. The disturbing call came in around 2.20 this morning near 68th and State in Chicago's Park Manor neighborhood. A 43-year-old officer was responding to a call for some type of domestic dispute. He was taking a statement from a 24-year-old woman when a red Chevy Cruiser came down the street and hit both of them, then took off. All right, we're getting a red Chevy Cruiser that went northbound from 6-8 and State. Again, that's a red Chevy Cruiser. While police searched for the car, first responders were on scene helping either the officer or the woman hit. Police Superintendent Eddie Johnson talked to us about the hit and run at today's Pride Parade. But that just goes to show you again that the dangers that police face out here day in and day out, but yet still they strap on their gun and vest and go out and protect the uh, citizens of Chicago. Charges are pending against that driver, but good news for the officer. We're told he's been released from the hospital and is recovering tonight at home. As for the woman at last check, she was still in the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Live outside Chicago Police Headquarters, Audrina Vegas, CBS 2 News. Jim and Mai. Thank you, Audrina.